Whether they're waking up in Washington, California, Denver, or Mexico, Russell Wilson and Ciara have plenty of gorgeous properties to celebrate. Their main mansion was located in Bellevue, Washington, but they also own a place in San Diego, complete with their own private football field. Little is known about the couple's California home, but we will discuss what we do know and explore their former main residence in Washington, which was put on the market for a whopping $36 million. The asking price gradually dropped over two years time, sitting at $25 million and was finally sold in March of 2024 for $21 million or just over. Don't worry, they also had some vacant land next to the house, which they also sold, earning the couple a grand total of $31 million, triple what they originally paid for the property. The lakefront home in Bellevue, about 10 miles from Seattle, will be a tough spot to let go of, with its scenic views perched on top of a mountain looking over Lake Washington. Built in 2007, the roughly 11,000 square foot house sits on about one acre. The Wilsons renovated the home, which has a gym, a home theater, a yoga and dance studio, Studio and more. Outside, the Wilsons installed a two story treehouse for their kids, as well as a tram that runs down to the lakefront where there's a dock, but that's all water under the bridge now. In early 2022, Russell was traded from the Seattle Seahawks to the Denver Broncos. In 2024, he was traded to the Pittsburgh Steelers, so we have quite a few pieces of property to get through on this video. My name's Kara the Vampire Slayer. Let me know who you want me to feature next. And now let's get in to Sierra and Russell Wilson's homes. Russell's estimated net worth is about $165 million, while Ciara's is around $20 million, making them a very well-off couple. As you'd expect from someone with one of the highest paychecks in the NFL, the Wilsons have been able to beef up a pretty incredible portfolio of properties. A few years after Sierra's breakout success with her hit studio album Goodies, she bought a condo in Atlanta for around 680K. Details about this property are scarce, but it's known that Sierra kept it for nearly 10 years before selling it for 520K in 2015. That is the same year she and Russell Wilson purchased a home in Washington State, which is the house we discussed in the intro. Spending just $6.7 million and then purchasing an empty lot next door for a similar price was a pretty big investment that paid off big time. The current owners remain a bit of a mystery, but surely they're gonna be enjoying its five-star amenities that the couple poured into this one-of-a-kind pad. Previous to this, Russell already had some property in San Diego, and it's pretty impressive for a backup home or one they refer to as their home away from home. Located outside of San Diego in Rancho Santa Fe, the property extends over eight acres and used to be an equestrian estate. This came in handy for Wilson as he converted the horse arena into a football field, where he and his teammates on the Seahawks would practice every off season. Now, details of this house are limited, but we were able to find the real estate video which was posted to YouTube seven years ago. The gated entry aligned with towering day Palms introduces the equestrian themed grounds. Inside a dramatic foyer with two curving staircases leads to the main residence, which includes seven ensuite bedrooms. The main level master suite features a rotunda sitting room, spa bath, and massage and vanity rooms. The grand salon with soaring ceilings opens to a covered porch overlooking a lagoon inspired pool with a grotto, waterfalls, spa, and slide. Exceptional finishes like wrought iron details, fireplaces, and more provide a five-star ambiance. Additional amenities like a peaceful dining room with a private patio and fountain, a state-of-the-art theater, a billiards room with a pub bar and wine room, a well-appointed kitchen and morning room are also included. Outside, there are multiple patios and covered patios with fountains, an entertainment pavilion, cooking stations, a bar and lounge, a guest house, a gym and arcade building, and a sunken tennis and basketball court. From what we can tell, the couple still owns this property, but have added many more to their portfolio, even gifting a mansion to Russell's mother on Mother's Day back in 2019. Now, when Russell was traded to the Broncos, it was time for the couple to go house hunting again. He and Ciara purchased a European-inspired estate in Cherry Hills Village, just outside Denver, for a reported $25 million. This 11,000 square foot mansion set a new record for the most expensive residential property in the Denver area. With celebrity level amenities, it's easy to see why. 
why. The four bedroom home features seven full baths and five half baths, along with a one bedroom, one bathroom guest apartment above a detached nine car garage. The property also boasts a wood panel dining room, a screening room and indoor pool, a basketball court and an outdoor fireplace. The large stone exterior and wooden interiors create a cozy and expansive retreat. When Russell was again traded to the Pittsburgh Steelers, this house was sold at a loss of $3.5 million, selling for $21.5 million. After taking a hit like that, it's not clear if Russell and Ciara decided to purchase a house in Pittsburgh or rent during the season. We do know they have other pieces of property in their portfolio, like homes in LA and Mexico. Info on these two spots are limited, but if you follow the couple on Instagram, you will catch a glimpse of their extraordinary lives and opulent lifestyles. That's it for our Ciara and Russell Wilson house tour. Let me know who to feature next on this channel and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!